All right, what's up YouTube? As you can see, back in the shed. Been a little while. If you checked out my last video, you you might know that I was about to have uh, my second child, and we did. If you checked my Instagram, you would have saw a, like a little photo for half a second when I was talking. But yeah, basically had a second boy. Everything was happy days. Awesome little dude. Still tiny. You know. But yeah, super cute. Uh, lots of fun. So, but finally getting back in the shed. I've had about a month or so off. Not from work. I only had a couple weeks off from work. But then it's just been sort of work and family, work and family, firm. And now I'm just sort of putting a little bit of time into the shed. So, uh, video's probably going to be a bit sporadic. And I, while I was not working um, in the shed, I've sort of been thinking about YouTube and a lot of that sort of stuff. And I feel like I'm... I really don't like the way I've been talking up until now, up until actually the last video I really liked. And the last video was easy for me to shoot because I was just having fun and it was, yeah, I, th I think I did a lot better with that one. So I'm going to try to keep these intros a bit lighter, a bit funner. Uh, you might hear a few F-bombs here and there. You might hear a few mistakes in words because I do have a bit of dyslexia. So sometimes I say like total wrong words. But then I'll try to remember the right word and uh, say it. So yeah, basically, <laughs> I'm hoping everyone likes the intros a little bit more when they're a bit funner. A bit more, woohoo, yee! Yeah, I make weird sounds too sometimes. So that's, yeah, that is something. <laughs> Alright, so, next project is going to be this. Which, you're probably thinking, yeah, you just went to Kmart and brought a bike. That's not a project. It is going to be a project because I'm... Um, Gonna be taking this out, it's gonna be for my boy. Obviously, none of this is like sponsored or any of that shit, but I mean, you know, if someone wants to hit me up, but you know, yeah. Um, yeah, I just brought it because um, my older boy is getting too big for his little trike, and he loves his trike, but he's just getting too big for it. Because um, it's like just one of those basic plastic ones that anyone in Australia probably has, everyone in Australia probably has, because like they're super common and they're like 10 bucks or something. And he loves it, charges down all the hills and stuff. So we just want something just a little bit bigger so he's not sort of, yeah, he can just ride a bit easier and start to head in the direction of of a, of two wheel bikes. So I picked up this balance bike, but I'm gonna be modifying it into a trike bike, balance bikey thing. And I know you can buy two in ones, but they're all more expensive and it just seems ridiculous when I could just as easily do it. So, pick this up. Super cheap. We're gonna take it apart. Well, well, we're gonna open it up because it's already apart. We're gonna look at all the parts, and basically the idea is that I'm gonna make it into a trike. But then I also want to potentially remake a lot of the pieces because it's all timber. So I'm either gonna be taking apart and refinishing the timber that they have and making it look way cooler and different. Or I'll remake the pieces. Not 100% sure. Just kind of winging it. So yeah, we're going to do that. And let's get into it. So, that's basically the setup. Pretty basic. But uh... Bonk, 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 bonk. Should be pretty fun for the little dude. Now to figure out all the rest of what I'm gonna do. done now pretty happy turned out pretty mint a few things not right these holes had to be I had to redo that again to bring it lower but that's all right as a sort of idea and a kind of semi proto not prototype but I just kind of was winging it and figuring it out as I went so I might eventually sort of pick up another one and do a few things better but this system here works really well with the stainless steel and threaded rod through it 
It's really nice and solid. It's taken his weight really well. And yeah, overall, pretty happy. Definitely could have been better, but I think for a, for a bike, there's just going to be a sort of uh, intermission between you know the next size up and actually going on to real bikes and so on. I think it'll work really well, and then I can drop back to a normal bike later on, or I might end up just leaving it until uh, Charlie's ready for it. But we'll see how we go. So if you want to hit like, that'll be sick. If you want to hit subscribe, that'll be awesome. Till the next one, peace.